Hello all and welcome back to my channel. My name is Chandramani Pandey and thank you very much for watching my other videos. In the last video, I showed you how to add the logged in user to the local admin group. In this video, I will show you how you can remove the logged in user from the local admin group. So let me show you first that if I open CMD. And run a command called who am I? We can see that I am logged in with CMP account. And if I am running with UPN, then we can see that this is my email ID. And if we go to the local admin group, let me go to that. and open the local users and groups and within the groups if you open the administrator group we can see that this account is already added cmp account is a part of local administrator now let's see how we can remove this logged in user from the local admin group so to do this we have to create a detection and remediation script so let me go to the engine portal and go to the devices and then we have to create a script and remediations. And let's create a script. And I will provide the name called remove logged on user from the local admin group. Same thing I will add in the description. Click on next. And then we have to provide the detection and remediation script. I have already downloaded the detection and remediation script and I will provide the link in the description section. So let me add the detection script which I already have in my download folder. So this is my detection script and same thing we have to do for the remediation script. So let me select the remediation script and in the other options let's run the script in 64 bit PowerShell. Click on next and then click on next and if you want you can add a specific group of devices but for now I will run a on demand protective remediation to show you how we can remove this. So let me click on next and click on create. Now we have successfully created the scripts so let me go to the devices and search for the device on which you want to run this script so this is my device and then we have to run the remediation so let me click on three dots and click on run remediation and then select the script which you want to deploy in my case remove logged on user from local admin group and before clicking on run remediation let me open the log which we already created while adding the user in the local admin and the log location is under program data Microsoft Intune management extension logs and then we have a log called local admin management Intune now we can see that last time we added the user now in the same log we will see some entries for removal of the user so let me go to the Intune portal and click on run now remediation is in pending state let me go to the log now we can see that it started detecting the user is a part of local admin yes user is a local administrator because user is a local administrator it is now rem removing the user from the local administrator and then it will again rerun the detection script to check whether the user is removed from the local admin now we can see that the cmp is not a local administrator and machine is also compliant now if we go to the local users and groups and go to the administrator now we can see that the cmp is not a part of local administrator so this is how we can remove the current logged in users if it is already part of the local administrator using Intune Protective Detection and Remediation script. 
and for the reporting purpose again you have to go to the intune portal and then you have to go to the scripts and remediation and then you have to open the script and now if you go to the device status and add a column called pre-remediation detection output and post-remediation detection output and click apply now we can see that in pre-remediation detection output this particular user is a part of local administrator because of this machine is not compliant and now in the post-remediation detection output this particular user is not a local administrator and so that machine is compliant so that's all I want to show you how you can remove the logged on user from local admin group using Intune Productive Detection and Remediation Script. I hope this is an informative video for you. Thank you very much for watching this video.